Good day, everyone, and welcome. Uh, we're going to be playing uh, Liminal Gallery. Um, this is a game that someone said, hey, you should check it out. All right. Uh, this is someone who I trust to, you know, take a look at the game and stuff. Um, they didn't tell me much on it. They want, they said they want me to be surprised. So I'm guessing, um, you know, I, I kind of have the a little bit of the basics of it, I should say. They, they gave me a little bit of the basics of it, but uh, the fact that they said that they thought they wanted me to be surprised, I should say, uh, that, that kind of tells me that mm, I have a pretty good idea based off of who recommended this, what to expect in it. But uh, we'll see how much that proves true. So let, let's take a look here at the game. Okay, so um, let's see here. Okay, um, there's a radio, hope we don't get any uh, copyright issues here. Uh, no photos or video allowed, okay, they're very clear on that. Oh, okay, there was something there that said we couldn't go through and now it's gone. Saying the gallery was closed, alright, well let's, uh, yeah I don't really, okay so it's left click there to interact with it. Okay, uh, door. This is, um, hmm. Whoa! Um, ooh. Okay. Something tells me I should be looking for a med kit, but there appears to be no health bar, so I'm not going to worry about that for now. Um, first of all, I've just got to say, whoever decorated this place, um, they've got very interesting tastes. We've got, uh, like some Grecian columns, uh, well, you know, Greco-Roman column type thing there. Um, weird print, uh, that kind of makes me think of, uh, zebra, even though not black and white. Um, and overall, I don't think I'm getting my money's worth out of this gallery because, um, well, I feel like I've seen this one over there. It's just a picture of some wood. What's next? They're just gonna tape a banana on there? Okay, so apparently we can also take the art. How nice. Okay. I can aim with left click. That's interesting. Oh no, sorry, right click. Alright, yeah. I and then left click to accept. Alright. There, there's no crouch here or anything. Alright. Alright, so we've taken the painting out of the frame. Mind the step. It's not quite a Perfect, uh, perfect little bit there. All right, uh, so far so good, so far so simple, and nothing has tried to kill me yet. That's nice. Okay, um, I don't know if this is how the artist intended it to be, but here, here's my zebra walls. Um, okay, let's take it. Um, I assume, okay, yeah, I can scroll to rotate. That's nice. Um, can't wait to get out of here, honestly. Um, I'm tempted to kind of fool around here. All right, that, that, that actually is pretty good. I mean, it's only a little step this time, although now it's a tripping hazard for, uh, people. Also, I'm not sure if what that says, but I'm guessing we're supposed to open the door. Okay. Um, we've got some, like, bars here that we cannot progress through. Can we? Okay, they made it just big enough. Already trying to break the game. Alright, let's see what we got here. Oh, we've got a door. Hmm. Well, I doubt we're... Can you actually... Yeah, well, apparently we can't go back through there. Alright, well, let's... Uh, um... Actually, this brings up an interesting question here. Um, let's just place it like this for now. Oh. Oh. Oh, I think we need to reset here. Hang on. Okay, so uh, the next level here. Yeah, I don't think that's going to work. Um, oh, let's see if we can get it just right here. See, this game is not good for people who 
like things to be perfect and symmetrical and that's about as good as it's gonna get that looks pretty good oh i didn't get the wall right should have backed up maybe a bit more ah still just a tiniest step Okay, I can't see anything down there. That's somewhat worrisome. I mean, there could be nothing down there. Okay, so far so good. Um, well, this is weird. Uh, this, what could possibly go wrong with this one? I mean, honestly, this, this looks perfectly fine. Just a bunch of shadowy figures there. Uh, probably want to be careful not to... Oh, that works, I guess. And another one. Okay. Uh, let's... I mean, this worked so far, so let's just keep going with it there. Okay, this is starting to feel repetitive. A little bit of a loop, maybe? Should I be... Oh, wait, this one looks different. All right. This one's different. I don't even have to rotate this one. Yeah, okay. Lovely. All right, you know, I can't, so far, this is, I think, my favorite room. This isn't too bad. Oh, all right. Um, I'm guessing we're supposed to get that one and we're supposed to use this one to get it. However, don't I don't see how you could possibly use that to get that um, all right we might have to reset I'm just gonna try and place it down somewhere um, let's try here okay uh, I hope I didn't mess all right so oh boy start to cue uh, the Doctor Who music <laughs> Ah, yes, stairs. I can use these. Um, I wouldn't mind a game that really makes one think of a uh, MC Etcher uh, painting or sketch, I should say. Um, yeah, I'd like a game all about that. All right, uh, how do we want to do this? Um, we need to get up, but we got to be careful how we get up. Let's try that. That works. Yeah, that works. That works brilliantly. Brilliant. All right. Uh, where the heck am I going to... All right, let's just put it here. All right, I take what I said. This is now my favorite one here. We're going into Windows XP, everyone. Oh, well, this is kind of disappointing, actually. Would have liked to have seen a little bit more here. Although this is slowly turning into uh, like an MC uh, etcher painting there. Uh, let's just... Hmm, this one's on the diagonal. Let's do it that way. Oh. Okay, well, that works. You know, the, the light kind of ruins it there just a bit. I'm liking the vibe so far. I'm liking this so far. Uh, nothing's tried to kill. Is this water? What happens if we go backwards here? What? Okay, if we go this way. All right, so. If I'm understanding this right, this is just a, uh, you know, a, 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 yeah, all right. So it doesn't matter which way we go. But the more interesting thing is, is that I don't see a door anywhere. So how did we get in here? Um, so I guess we go this way. Okay. Well, I mean, it, it's nice and all, but it's a, it's a bit rough, I'd say. I mean... Ducks don't really look all that realistic. The 
trees could use a little work there. So it's not it's not winning any awards for as far as realism goes. Now the question I have is do we have to worry about water flooding? Let's see about that. I'm kind of curious. Okay, so uh, water does not flow into water here. Oh, it's an actual three-dimensional duck this time. It's like a banana. Uh, banana plant. More so than a tree there a bit. I'm just curious. Okay, yeah, so we found the... Uh, edge of the world there giant waterfall this you know what do you know what this game has proven the flat earthers are right the flat earthers are right although we're kind of on the diagonal here so let, let, let's try and straighten that out oh that's kind of interesting a lot more ducks this time these ducks kind of make me think of a uh, duck uh, boat thing that um, was used in that Batman movie. Just kind of want to see anything. Oh, there's a duck hiding back here. Okay, that's interesting. Well. Oh. I mean, generally, I don't choose a checkered board wall, uh, uh, you know, a checkered board, the chessboard, really, in this case, but a checkered pattern on the walls and the floor. I mean, that that seems kind of. Well, time to hire an exterminator, I guess. Okay, hold on a second. This ain't right. There were three bananas in this painting. I only got one. What's this world coming to? Is that one of the Men in Black agents? I guess not. All right. Well, that's not all creepy. So far, um, I much prefer Duckland. Oh, I don't I don't like this. I I don't like this. Can't see the floor. Alright, if this is supposed to be creepy, I guess they didn't realize I'm making this video for a bunch of eyes to watch at some point. I mean right now there are eyes watching me, so this isn't that creepy. I mean, the fact that they're following me, that's a little creepy, I guess, but. Okay, so we got to get there, apparently. Hmm. Well, uh, viewers, uh, you know, let me know in the comments below what you think about this situation. I guess I just walk straight up. Must be kind of lonely in there. All right. Like a camera, but I'm not allowed a camera. There was a specific rule saying no cameras. Uh, oh. Okay. Um, ooh, I feel like I need to back up a bit there. Um, I'm not really sure where the edge of this room is, but... Uh, let, let's see here. Um, looks like we got like a limited number of photos we can take, so we're at like three. Okay. Um, there's no zoom button here, it seems. That's a pretty good shot. All right, let's try it. Um... Kyle's got a little bit smaller there. Also, this is a terrible camera. I mean, 
it, all there's look at the look at the color. I mean it, it ew, no. I want a better camera. One with a zoom function and better color. Ooh. Well, I mean it is a Polaroid, but I've seen better Polaroids than this. Okay, let let's see here. I think I got everything in the viewfinder there. Lovely. Alright, and I'm guessing I can rotate it. I'm gonna have to bring it down just a touch. See, I wish there was like a crouch here. That way I could, you know, not put it at an angle and not have the step. That would be nice. Hang on, let, let's see here if we can't make this a little better. Ah, we'll just go for it. Yeah, I mean... Is it specifically all black and white? Is it a black and white camera? I can't really tell. It feels like there's a little bit of color still in there. It's just really poor saturation there and stuff. Um, oh, wow. This is interesting. Hmm. I mean, I feel like there's a couple ways this could be solved. The first way is to just take a picture of what's up there and then fall down. The second would be to just take a picture of the door, rotate it, and put it there. Um, let's try. Let's try both. Just just for argument's sake here. Let's try that. See if that works. Oh well, I guess we're still going to fall down somewhat here, uh, but. Okay. Oh dear, that's not good. That doesn't work. Well, I guess I die or fall forever. Okay, let's try that again. Let, let's do it the uh, gravity way here. Let's take a picture like that. And actually, you know what? Let, let's, let's place it just like that. Perfect. Oh, I don't know if that's going to work. <gasps> nope. Wait, yes. Okay, good. All right, I mean, this worked. Door must be upright. Well, you didn't specify that. Is that the door I came in? I think so. Can I jump on the column to get out? Oh, nope. Okay, take three. Um, you know, let, let's try this again. All right, take the picture. And let's just fall straight down, I guess. All right, there we go. Very picky, that one. Very picky. You took the camera film. Yes, I did. Okay. Now, so far, from what I've realized, is that it, it, it takes things very, um, literally here, so I don't think I don't think I can just take a picture of it and move it up here because there's still going to be the long gap down there. Um, assuming there's a long gap down there. Um, instead, when I'm wondering, the way to do this might be, let's see here. Let's try taking a picture of the hallway. Yeah, there we go. Um, but we... Ooh, wait. We can't exactly... That will erase the door, won't it? Uh, what if we do this? Uh, we just can't place it on the door itself. See, uh, mm. Not sure if I did this right. Hang on. Yeah, that cut the door, so that's not going to work. Okay, attempt to... Let's see here. How can we do this? Let's try and do it in two, but I'm... Let's try this. It says I've only got one photo left. Oh. Um... Whoa! That works. Oh, wait, yeah, door must be upright. Well, game, here we are. 
an IQ test in me. All right, last time we tried the issue with the wall. All right, we need some negative space is what part of the problem is. Okay, so I've got an idea here. I'm gonna take a picture of the floor. And I'm gonna place it as I jump. Uh, I forgot to get the extra film. On. Uh, but we're going to need two, I think, to be able to make it here, so... Oh, shoot, I messed it up. There we go, that did it. Just take two pictures like that, that works. I'm sure there's a better way to have done it, but that works. Okay, uh, this seems pretty straightforward. But we can do a little, I got an idea here. Let's make sure we get the door nice and square there. Excellent. Then we'll rotate it and let's go ahead and place it this way here. Oh, wait, door has to be right side up, doesn't it? Problem, we'll just rotate the door right side up. Um, in fact, well, let's actually do it over here. Boom, that works. Okay, so now we gotta get past here. Hmm, how do we wanna do that? Actually, you know what? Hang on. Let's uh Let's try that. Let's see here. And if position it ever so rightly. Yeah, there we go. All right. Um, let's get another one of that there. Yeah, that was the one with the table. Let's try it the other way. Let's try it from here. And let's try getting that. that let's try that. These are wonderful pictures. I think I need to reevaluate my life here and try Try going into photography full time or something here. Yeah, that, 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 that's not at all weird. I mean, this is a perfectly normal game after all. Yay. Ooh, wow, a lot. Excellent. Okay, we got a pillar there, pillar there. I, mean, I think the obvious solution is to just take a bunch of pictures of stairs. Um, let's try that. Well, I can't get it all into the viewfinder there. They didn't make the room big enough. If we took it... Maybe the real solution is to try and use the lights. Um, now nah, let, let's, let's go with the more obvious solution there. Let, let's do it this way. That gets most of it in. Okay. Next. Oh, shoot. I just realized there might be a problem with what I did. Um, let's hope not. Yeah, that would be the worst scenario right there. Yeah, I, I was afraid of this. Ha oh, no, wait. This works out well. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that, that works. It's not as disastrous as I thought my shot there. The game's a little bit more generous than I was expecting this time. Oh, I really should get it closer to the edge there of the stairs. Um, yeah, that's that works. Excellent. 
Uh, we need what? Two more shots. One more shot. Let, let's get a good one this time. Let, let, let's. There we go. I mean, I'm creating art here. This is not just a game about, you know, solving a puzzle here. This, this is art in the making. Oh, that's it. Okay. Okay, so we've got like a little garden area here. Um, this seems pretty self-explanatory, I think. I mean, we got something up there. We got to get up there. So let, let's let's try and center ourselves here. Um, get that nice. All right. So far, not as spooky as I expected from the person who sent this. All right, let's get you right side up there. Ooh. Yeah, that was at a slight angle, so gravity's kind of off. Everything's a little bit crooked there. It's amazing how, by how much. All right. Um, I wonder if... Wait a second. Oh, there, there's my little hole. What's that over there, I wonder? I want to kind of look with the camera. All right, let, let, let's get this uh, somewhat settled here. I, I'm kind of curious. What, what's going on up there? What? Huh. This is where, you know, if they may, if there's if if a sequel was made to this, I'd, I'd kind of like it to. Um, I'd really like it if it had uh, a zoom function there. Oh, OK, there's the original. Yeah, what, what's going on there with that, I wonder? Okay. We can visit other places, I guess. Sort of. Wow, I wish someone was taking a picture here. I'd look huge. Look like a giant. Okay, I guess we don't want to go behind the building. Looking rather dapper there, my friend. Um, yeah, I don't think I want to go to space. I, I feel like that's like a portal moment there. Uh, you know, you, you don't want to go play, uh, seeing a portal on the moon there. Portal 2, actually. Kind of looks like an inflatable one there. Nice sunglasses, by the way. Yeah, we're, we're not placing the space one. I don't want to suck all the air out. Okay, we have yet another one. Let's just throw this down somewhere. Actually, this has been the straightest one I've placed yet, I think. Yeah, look at this. This is this is pretty good. I'm wondering if I've managed to put myself in some kind of an endless loop. Or maybe not. Let's see here. I'm not really sure what's straight anymore, so we're just going to go with it. I mean, everything's a little bit relative here. Let's hope this counts. All right, that one counted. Good. Excellent. Ooh, wow. Oh, no. Oh, this isn't good. What did I tell you about taking a picture and, you know, we're going to suck all the air out to the moon? This is just like Portal 2. Um. Oh boy. Well, here goes nothing. Um, let's at least try and limit the damage here. Let let let's place it like this. This is kind of looking like uh some kind of cool futuristic door. Actually, you know what? I guess that doesn't really work, does it? Um, I guess I kind of have to place it down and fall towards the moon, which makes this a little bit dip. Actually, now that we've got a bigger moon, let's let's try. And there we go. All right, we'll use that. And I'm right on the edge there, so. All right, here goes nothing. Goodbye, cruel world. Whee! This is probably the fastest anyone's ever gotten to the moon. Okay, this is interesting. My my next question is, is the moon a sphere? 
the moon is spherical. I can actually walk around on the moon. We don't have moon gravity. If anything, gravity is a lot higher here. Okay. You know, all right. Actually, let's do a little experimentation since we reached the end of the game here. But I'm, I'm wondering, can I take a picture? And then... Oh, I don't want to do it yet. I, I want to see. Okay. So we're going to pick a direction. And let's try and walk around the moon. Let's see here. Will it let me walk all the way around the moon? This is already doing a better job than some space games I know. Okay, we, we're approaching some uh, issues here. Uh-oh. Ah! Okay, emergency. <laughs> um... All right, uh, hang on. Let's see if that worked. Yeah, that seems to have worked. <laughs> okay, wow, that that was certainly uh, interesting there. Uh, thanks for playing, created by Ken Forrest. Thank you, Ken Forrest, for this uh, great game. Um, that was fun, uh, and I'm at, apparently you can't quite go around walking on the moon, but uh, came pretty close there. I mean, honestly, that was so far better physics than I've seen from some space games, so uh, well done there on that. All right, well, uh, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, let me know if you'd like to see anything else like this, you know, some quick little games like this. Uh, if you would like to take a look at it and have some fun with the game, uh, you can get it on uh, itch.io. Uh, a link will be available in the description there for it. And, uh, yeah, I mean, <laughs> this was a nice little fun thing here. Uh, the game is available for free, but you, it, it is encouraged that you uh, donate, you know, uh, to support the game. So you, it's pay what you want. It's pay what you want. And, uh, yeah, that, this was fun. This was fun. We need more little projects like this, although I kind of would like more. That's the success there. I want to play more. <laughs> All right.